What is going on, you guys? This is Ultron 2. Welcome back to the Ultron 2 show coming to live by the power of the internet. So, guys, check this out. So, we have a very unfortunate and disturbing video here. So, you guys know about Kappa. I'm not going to explain it. If you want to know what Kappa is, go look it up on YouTube. For those who do know about Kappa, um,. Like I said in my last video, they came back to haunt us. So, unfortunately, I think this YouTuber is going to definitely get fined. Because, first of all, this is the same YouTuber that made that. Not the video that I'm watching, but there was a YouTuber that made the anime Spongebob film for his YouTube channel. Him and other people spent like six months ma making it. It was going viral all over YouTube and on my notifications and on Google for those who are subscribed to the channel. Um, you guys, the channel, remember the video got taken down off of YouTube because of their bots and because of the FTC and COPPA. So, the way things are looking, guys, this person may get fined from the FTC. So, let's see this video real quick. So a big YouTuber has actually just been hit by Kappa. They've made this anime series for Spongebob, obviously some type of parody content, and YouTube took down their video. YouTube told them that it was because they violated their child safety policy, even though the YouTuber marked the video as not Come made for on, kids. Man. This is a bit of a trailer for it. I watched through it. It wasn't that inappropriate, but it definitely wasn't made for kids. There was some blood and stuff. And this YouTuber did mark the trailer and the episode one YouTube itself, which was stuff. a video that got taken down by YouTube as not made for kids, as you can see their playlist option is available and the comments are too but here's a message from youtube saying hi narmac our team has reviewed your content and unfortunately we think it violates our child safety policy long story short youtube is saying we think that you have mislabeled your video the audience setting for your video and i think it's pretty easy to see why it has happened youtube's automated system probably saw the word spongebob in the title so it was like okay regardless of the context of this video this video is probably being targeted towards kids because Spongebob is in it. Which is obviously a very terrible way for YouTube to evaluate content because look at all the YouTube poops out there. But this actually gave this person's channel an official strike. So now they're going to have some privileges of their channel revoked. And they kept talking about why this bothered them. They said, clear intent to target younger minors and families, which was a quote from YouTube. Are you serious? Did someone actually watch that video? Gonna get that? Fine. Are you going to damn six months of my life spent on making something and give me a strike? This is unbelievable. They've said that they appealed it. They've tried to contact bigger YouTubers. Shout out to Master77. He's the one who showed me this tweet. He's a viewer of mine. And yeah, he showed the audience setting for it itself. And he showed that it is not marked as made for kids. So yeah, COPPA officially strikes. So you know what? When you think about it, it actually is good that they didn't get fined though. Because YouTube did say that if you violate the COPPA update or they feel like you violated the COPPA update, you will be fined according to how much money your video made. So it looks like Narmac isn't getting fined right now, but hopefully they won't be getting fined in the future but they still did get a strike on their channel which is a very very big deal typically you want to go throughout your youtube career without having any strikes on your youtube channel and if you even have one a lot of your channel privileges will be revoked i believe you can't live stream anymore other things like that but yeah this channel is all based on parody content for some kids shows but yeah this whole spongebob anime thing seems to have been in the works from this creator for a very very long time so it is pretty messed up that youtube has taken down their months of hard work just because youtube's bots aren't competent enough to act actually tell the difference between parody content and actual content that is being aimed towards children. But yeah, COPPA officially strikes. Hopefully this guy gets this sorted out. Please like the video if you enjoyed it and subscribe for more. See ya. Guys, let me know down in the comments what you think about this situation. This YouTuber could possibly get fined by the FCC. It's very possible because COPPA and YouTube has been involved in this video being taken down so i feel bad for this guy i hope he sorts something out with youtube if he can get the video back or whatever um it sucks man it's tough guys let me know down in the comments what you think this is ultron 2 signing out and peace